Hi guys, welcome back to Red Dog Gaming, where today we are continuing our Rome Total War campaign as the Julii Romans. Now the Macedonians have attacked us here while we've been sieging down Larissa, which is actually perfect for us because we did not want to fight all these uh, pikemen in the city. Now in terms of cavalry, we actually don't have a dominance here. So yeah, they've got four cavalry, the same as us, and one general in here, but they've also got a general and two cavalry in this one. So this first army, they're going to attack us from the front. Yeah, this small one. And these guys are going to come in from the back. So we need to be quick about these. What else do they have? Mercenary hoplites and then two of those peasant things. They, that should be no problem at all to take that out. We just need to kill him. And he's a rubbish general. This guy's an all right general. Our guy's not great, Bibius, and he's 44, so it'd be nice if Amulius would take over, but Bibius is leading at the minute. So we'll listen to the general speech, and then we'll go smash that first army and then the second. Brave warriors! I have won great renown through leading men to victory. I see no reason to change the habits of a lifetime today. Macedon's army stands in the field. Do not fear them, for they will die easily, like other men. Are you men enough to win this battle? Are you equal to the challenge? If you are, then plunder and loot await. This is the last obstacle in our way before the city walls. Win here, and you can stroll to your prize. We stand on the defensive today. Let them wear themselves out against our battle line. There are a few more of them than there are of us, but so what? Yet, for all that, one of you is worth more than any number of them. Skills, valor, and honor still count for something in war. We may be able to hide men in the woods nearby. With luck, that would be a surprise for our foes. We are lacking in spearmen today. And the many enemy horsemen may make life a little hectic if we are not careful. The hair has been gutted, and the liver was as clear as day. Portents such as this can only be considered good. Today, the carrion birds feast, but they will feast upon our enemies, not on good Roman flesh! That was a bit long-winded, wasn't it? Bloody hell. Normally the speeches are pretty epic in this, but... Oh, that guy was boring. But he, uh... Vibius. Is it Vibius? I think it's Vibius. And then, well, Amulius with him as well. I think we can do this just with our cavalry. Um, maybe archers as well. I don't know. These Thracian mercenaries, your reserves. Spearmen will put you either side. You can get into the action if the cavalry charge. Should be alright to do this just with our cavalry though. Probably hope they just take out one at a time. So he said we'll, they'll wear themselves out against our defensive line, but this first army we're going to try and destroy them straight away. And then we'll worry about them wearing themselves out against our defensive line for the second army. We'll probably wait for them in the middle as well so we can kill as many of them as possible because we need to kill both the general and 85% of this army to get the city. I'm surprised they're not turning around here. If I charge that guy in the side their general's definitely going to charge me back so I'll wait for them to move and let's all go and surround him. We're in a good position to kind of surround him as well. Get some wedge formation. Yeah. That's all, that's all. Charge, 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 come on. Yeah, that's our general in the middle there, but I'm sure they'll break before they kill it. Hopefully, anyway. <laughs> yeah, there we are. Their cavalry is running through us as well. Let's get here. They don't know what to do. This general is the most important thing. So, you four, you three, here, we'll charge you in the back. Okay, put these guys around the side, they're, more, they're stronger. So we completely surround this guy so he can't escape. 
should have killed a lot of him there. Yeah, there he's going, he's going. He needs to die though. Kill him, kill him, kill him. Oh no, look at him, he's just escaping. There he is. Dead, dead, dead. Nice. Everyone. Let's get the equites and be the ones who are tired. And then you three. Okay, they're actually coming at us quite quickly right now. So let's quickly turn around. All of you guys can be turned off that. Gracious. Okay, is that everyone dead? Apart from that singular unit. Oh, these guys as well. But there's only a tiny amount of them. Um, we'll all come up here. Now, okay, they're charging with their cavalry already. Let's go. Let's go. They're, they're, they're isolated. Let's go. Get into them. Let's get stuck in. We got the charge off, they didn't. Should have destroyed them. Around the side. It's one of them dead. The other one should be around, around some as well, straight away, to be honest. Yeah. How many is left of each one? 17 and 7. Not an issue. Now, the other cavalry contingents around the side. Where's their general? Quick, quick, quick. Don't do that. Don't do that. That's the general in the middle. Now, do we want to risk our Hastati being pummeled by their cavalry? I think we do. If we get Prinker Bays, bring these guys to maybe the side. And there's uh, Triarii somewhere in here. Because their general is in the middle. Their general could charge our middle, which, you know, always hurts when they do that. Especially when it's just against, like, standard Hastati. Now as we move forwards, they attacked us, so they should be coming to us. Let's uh, let's get forward. Let's go. Gracian mercenaries. These guys are isolated. They're gonna die. Very nice. Get rid of those peltists. Now, they can do some damage, these lancers, especially with the charge, so maybe I don't want to just leave my equites by themselves. Don't know who they're firing at right now. Grecians. They have a long enough range to target the general's bodyguard. They don't. Who are you firing at then? Peltasts. Light lancers, let's get rid of them. No, 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 no. Get away from that. Now, I'm going to probably just use the Hastati to um, hold the battle line again. Okay, General's coming. General's coming. Let's go. Let's see. Let's see what you've got. Hasbridal. Oh, not Hasbridal. Yeah, that was a Carthaginian. Let's see what you've got, Mr. Macedon. We got the charge off again. So, shouldn't be too bad. Just worry. Oh, there. General's dead straight away. Let us hope he does not poison the carrier birds. No. Nope. You guys get through, get through, get through without dying too much. Go, 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 go. Okay, just managed to get through that gap. Okay. Over here they attacked us, it seems. Yeah. How are we looking? Oh, no, 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 no. Get out, get out, get out. Yeah, you're routing now because you're a fucking idiot. Decide to charge into pikes. Yeah, they're broken. Looks like all these guys are just going to break from being touched. They're all levies. I, mean, I think there's one unit of all right pikemen somewhere. Phalanx pikemen there. That's the one unit that's all right. right. Oh, hello, Light Lancers. You just came back from routing right behind us. You can go and run down these peltists. Oh, we will as well. Get the whole gang back together. Yeah, there, there's a levy pikeman going. No. So where were the actual pike? Phalanx pike. These are the actual guys that are alright. Um, yeah, we want to just keep shooting these guys. 
that's just normal level you flip, they're fine. And they're shaken, they're not stirred. Get rid of these guys while we can. Now let's just mosh through these. These Peltas, how much have we killed? 65, not even that much. You are starty, let's come here. Get in there, come on. My lances keep coming back. It's kind of funny. How are we doing over here? Everyone's routing, apart from you. You're just Levy Pikeman now. Wow, archers have actually used, right, get out of there. We used uh, quite a lot of their uh, ammunition. They've actually used all of it for the first time in a long while. Okay, let's continue. Go, 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 get after these. How many we killed now? 83, we're very close. Killed the general as well. Yeah, we should do it. There's loads of troops left on the battlefield to run down. Okay, that has started rousing. 13. Mm, we might lose that unit, which would be bad. We'll see anyway. I don't want to use that, lose that unit, to be honest. Bit of a messy battle, but it was alright. That first, the first part of it was fine. Got rid of that other army very quickly. Now this bit was a bit messy, just because of the pikes. That is why we didn't want to have to deal with the pikes in the city. Would have been perpetual frustration. should be like okay we lost 15 so lost nearly 200 like this army was trash they did nothing they killed 11 of our men killed more men than they're in our whole army so that's all right casualty sustained yeah equity is taking a lot this this is starty they lost experience they didn't get any healing yeah it looks like i think this has started probably merged Hmm. Maybe not actually. It says there's 15 now. They have inflicted 101 as well. Oh, was that the archers? No, that's Astarte. These archers do an absolute bit. It's pretty nice. Quite a good, uh, quite a good little battle again. And we should take the rest of this time. Yeah, let's. Uh... Okay, they don't have plague. Let's ex uh, enslave them. A lot of that should have gone to Aretium. Hopefully make that, okay. Benefactor Nero Rex, which is over here. No, we don't want you, you're rubbish. You have no traits at all. all right, Vibius, I'm surprised. Let's see whether you got any, yeah. You got a slave trader, that's it. Okay, no, you got good command, plus two command. So now what are you? Now you're three. Not brilliant, but it's okay. Okay, the 15 survived. Good, good, good. Let's see. Don't think we will be able to make any more. Okay, that made them worse. Yeah, there's not going to be any silver ones, I don't think. Yeah, that's only two now. Um, you guys. Yeah. Uh, let's see, you got to try and Demeter, get rid of that. First thing you should do, probably get Shrine to Jupiter. Then let's retrain these guys, and oh, brilliant, we can train archers here. Not as good as the Cretan archers, look at that 13 missile attack with 2 experience. They're still good though, so we will probably want to get rid of these skirmishers because they're shite. Um, for archers and then we'll, we'll probably just get two more archers and then we'll march across right a lot of places haven't been building because we've had no money so let's see whether we can uh, get the money okay those spies nearly forgot about them so good job I took, took a look at that uh, Patavium what do we want here you're gonna be upgraded actually pretty soon so let's take the blacksmith 
while we can, because this is going to be our kind of uh, training hub in a few turns. Uh, Mediolanium. Let's take the walls. No, it doesn't matter too much. Um, aluminium, you're building. Suggest there. Let's take a look. Carolus. Suggest Dicka. Hmm, those mines would be nice. But you're better to probably build in other places, though, what we can. Carthage is unhappy. Potential for riots. That's the one problem with Carthage. It always seems to just get really unhappy. Yeah, low tax rate as well. Take some peasants. Okay, you can march forward. Take that cavalry. Just put you there. We'll just check all the armies first. Make sure we've done everything we can with them. Okay, so we're going to have two battles, it would seem. We're going to come this side, because generally there's an ambush army in, that, in there. So we're going to take Kaidonia. We're going to fight the Gauls. Now, what are we doing over here with this one? We're going to come down to Lepsis. Engage the enemy. Out of move, sir. Magna, I think it's called. Tripolitania, it's the region. Maybe this guy isn't helping. Why is he? He's actually a good general. He's a poor farmer. He's flexible, which is minus one from law. Minus one from squalor, though. Although, yeah. Minus one from Lord's definitely not helping. Devastation, where's that coming from? I don't see any rebels. I honestly don't see any rebels. Am I just being really dumb? Where are they? Probably hid in one of these trees. Pretty annoying. Uh, right. Spies. Send you round to here. You can probably go around that way, it doesn't matter too much. And you, Your Honor. we send up to, like, Elysia. So let's take this battle. Uh, it looks like it's not going to be on the bridge, which is good for us. Probably only need the cavalry for this, but we'll see. Hopefully get some more stats for the old general, uh, but we'll listen to the general's speech, see what he says. If it's just generic, we'll uh, skip it, I think. Today is a good day to die. But better still to live and tell our grandchildren, as yet unborn, of brave Romans who fought well. These goals do not need your fear. Cold steel will bring them down, just like any other man. They have been brought to the battlefield by mewling infants instead of leaders. The count of our warriors is vastly greater than theirs, so unless we fight like old women or idiots, victory is certain. They are lacking in spearmen, and this will work to the benefit of our large contingent of horsemen. I have fought these men many times, and even now they must be praying to their false gods for mercy. They will have little enough but from me. The auspices have been taken, and gods be praised, nothing can be found to deny us victory today. With such portents, we need only march upon the enemy. We go now to our bloody business! Whee! Nice one. Actually has, this guy, like, he's not that old, he actually, uh, he's like 30-something, isn't he? But he actually has fought the goals a lot of times from their incursions into our land. There's this big rock in the middle of the map here, so take these guys and these two, and I suppose we could split in two actually. Take you guys together, group, and we'll take you guys together, group you. Where are they? What? They're in the corner of the map. I mean, I suppose that makes sense. Don't have any missile units either. Why are you running? No need to be running, bro. Uh, literally in the corner on the hill. Kind of clever from the AI. Nice one. AI. Um. Uh, I mean, like literally a full frontal charge would destroy them right now, but. It would also destroy our 
lightly armoured Equites. And we need to kill the general to destroy this unit. So, probably want to get behind them. Get behind them either side. No, we'll do that. And then that It'll be easier to maneuver them and stuff for me anyway um, right I want you to come up here you can run now you guys I want you to come here okay let's play 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 okay no there oh god who which one of you walked around this way that was stupid, wasn't it? They're faster than my camera. Go, go, camera. No. Right. Don't want to... Uh, dealing with these warbands individually will actually be fine. So... Just need all you guys to come across here. They should distract them. Oh, right. Kill the general. Oh, they turn their back. They turn their back. Let's go, 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 go. Right, you just block these guys from coming in to side. The general's dead. Should make them rout. The enemy general is dead. His men know quick, their quick. doom approaches. Come through, come through. General's dead. We don't need to worry about that bodyguard. It's going to be gone anyway. They should instantly. Break, yep. The gods be praised. The enemy's Couple of you guys of can kill these. Yeah, nice. Get any experience? Maybe on this guy. Could have had experience before. Don't think on any of these. I think that was already. You there? Everything apart from this guy. All Rome will be amazed at such. And how many men we lost? Thirty-five. 35? Hmm. But I suppose it adds up like 5 on each of the Equites sort of thing. Now the problem with this army now is going to be that we're not most likely going to be able to retrain it very often. Probably only at Elysia. Because these towns, unless they've upgraded them, but the AI generally does a terrible job of upgrading their towns, so... Maybe uh, Massilia. That could have upgraded to a large town, I suppose. Sir. Okay, so we've done that. Now we want to take Kydonia. What is in there? So we've got Cretan archers. That's probably... We want to probably uh, train those guys. Um, as in, hire them. Hmm... Like this coming in is probably quite easy. We might send like one of our Princapes in just to kill the Grecian archers. Quite, uh, they're not hugely armoured, but their shield and their armour should be enough to just kill the Grecian archers. Uh, actually, now nah, let's let's just charge our cavalry in. Why would we? Why would we charge Princapes in? We Pick up to. the shield, grasp the spear, sharpen the sword's edge. This is a day of destiny. And fate of many will be decided in this place. Over there stand the rebel slaves. They are braver and more worthy than men of their type have any right to be. They stand alone. No friend has come to this place to die for them. Does this not say something about their honor? They're standing among nations. We outnumber them by a large margin. But this may drive them to foolhardy defiance. Be careful. Until the enemy walls crumble, our brave horsemen can do little. Let us breach those walls and hunt down the enemy. Huh? I have fought these men before, but they do not know me. They will, however, fear me by the end of the day. There is no shame in fear. There is only shame in letting fear rule you. Try not to look scared, and you'll find bravery in your heart!
Okay, cool. Interesting that he said we need to bring down the walls. They look already kind of brought down to me. Um, yeah, you should be one of these guys. Uh, I do also want to destroy the other army, so maybe we don't sit on the town square forever. Uh, you guys walk up this way. Um, and then, cavalry. Let's go. They might actually run, but I do want, like, they're rebels, so I, I think they won't. But I do want to destroy them. I don't want to just leave them on Kaidonia, because, you know, they might siege it down. Probably won't, because it's vanilla, but it's always a chance. The enemy general is slain, and now his right. men fear Now let's get out of it the walls time to quick. Press the attack. Shouldn't need, uh, shouldn't need our... Uh, Tree, really, if we can get out quick enough, come on. Yeah, we're running. All right, let's get around this way. Catch, actually, no, you go that way. You guys, um, what are those? They're Sicilian pirates, they're actually quite. Oh, Cretian archers. Let's get rid of them. They're firing our general as well. Let's go, 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 go. Forgot about these guys. Okay. The Sicilian pirates, let's get them before they can loose their javelins. Cretian archers. Come on. Charge him. The Sicilian pirates. Yeah, dead. The enemy general flees. He's dead. Great gods be praised. The enemy general is killed. Fear makes a home in our. Alright, that should hearts. be. How many of them were killed? Fifty-four percent. Right, there's only twenty-four of those guys left. So, breaking these two units and mopping up, mop, mopping them up. Oh. Right, while you turn, let's go. Yeah, broken. They're going to run into the town centre, aren't they? So, mop these guys up. Don't want them running into the town centre. And the infantry's like... Whoa. Look at that blob. <laughs> Horrible. Uh, we might just be able to break these guys by just standing near them. So, let's try overwhelming like they'll be like scared that they're surrounded and they'll say there's an overwhelming amount of enemies or something let's come forward wavering concerned exposed flanks see how close we can get hop like game of chicken Surely, go on, break. I mean, we'll just walk into them then. They <laughs> the <laughs> don't even know they're there. They're they were just facing the other way. From our men. Now we'll absolutely squish them. There we are, very nice. Nice. Such a victory. Get rid the of them. Kaidonia is ours. Not the best settlement, but still a good settlement, you know, as it gets upgraded. Lost a few men. Shouldn't be, I probably won't be able to upgrade these guys now, so we'll see. Victory! Okay, Masali is in the hands of Gaul. I didn't notice that before. That's probably why they've been sending through all the uh, um, armies. So, you're only a town, but you are unhappy. We'll, ex we'll uh, enslave you. You're still unhappy. Probably... Yeah, penalty, distance capital. Hmm, we might need to move our capital at some point. However, we're kind of in three different prongs. This side's going to be where we want to dominate, though. Like, if we come up here and take Iberia or whatever, it'd be fine. 
Um, now we need Jupiter for the law and the public order. We need a peasant. Do we have much movement? Not much. It's probably not worth us moving then. Turncoat slave, then that's not great because we're not going to be really fighting against rebels that much more. Uh, you're going down to Massalia. You're going across to there. You've taken Kydonia. Alright, let's take another... Take another turn. Let's just check. Well, there are places we can build, I would assume, but we just don't have the money right now. Now, we're building in a lot of places, so... Macedon, ceasefire. No, because if you've just lost Thessalonica, or Black... Well, uh, Bylazora... The Bruti, I should be going after Bylazora. That's their job. I'm not bothered about that. I just don't want them to come and take Suggestica. Fuck off, Senate. I don't care about you. Um, town grows Mediolanium. Good, good, good. Very nice. Spend a bit of money on it, but now we are the strongest faction. Probably Egypt just lost a, lost a battle or something. Now, Egypt's going to be quite hard. Not too hard, though. Should be all right. Um... Right, here on Palmer, we want to get population growth going even more, so take the sewers just because it's cheaper and you're not really a, uh, uh, a priority right now. Now Carthage, you're looking happier, still not happy enough. This guy, this guy's in, uh, flexible, so he's going to be adding to the corruption here. Athens, just take the sewers again. Larissa, Shrine to Jupiter. Larissa looks like it's a good place to train uh, troops, to be fair. Do any of these give... Yeah, no, they don't. No, it's just population growth and happiness, and then this is the law and happiness. None of them give experience to troops. Not directly. I assume the Pantheons do, but that's the Pantheon. No, that's just population growth. No. That's a bit of a law, and that's population growth. So the ones we're going to be getting are law, happiness, and population growth. Cool. That's fine. No experience to troops. The Scipio ones give you uh, experience to troops on one of them, but uh, for less, uh, what do you call it, law or uh, happiness. So you can, you know, target where you want to put those and get bonus experience and... I think, is it... Uh, it's experience and it's... Um, what do you call it? Imperator. Uh, armor. Armor and weapons. Let's see whether we can beat Kydonia. Yes, we can. Cretan archers? Yeah, let's take them. To the ship. Uh, that's a Brutii Navy, so we just want to probably stand next to it. And we'll come out and take Rhodes next turn. Now, this army, we're just waiting for one more archer. Then we'll have four archers in the army, which is pretty good. Uh, and we will go. Where are we going to go? Once we drop these guys off, I suppose we can come and pick them up. Probably going to go and get Halicarnassus, but I'm not too sure. General, right, can you reach there? Attack. Yeah, you can. Lepsis Magna. Settlement Looks like you've got some troops. Sir. Mainly trash. So, hmm, look at that. That's a big rebel army. Wonder how many. Okay, Carthage has Lily Balm as well. Lily Biome. So, hmm. Let's see what we've got. Okay, Engage okay. Gaul's upgraded it to a large town. That's quite good for us. Under sea, sir. Pretty full of troops, but it's a Gallic one, so you can know you can just surround the center. They look like they might come and attack us, which means we'll be on a river battle, I think. Which is pretty good actually. Uh, spies will move you up. Move you down here. Should have probably... I mean, our spy wouldn't have got there in time anyway. I was going to say we could have. Um, could have got them in there, but... Could have, we'd have to wait a turn anyway, so we're already waiting a turn for battering rams. So, not too much of an issue. Now, I'll just check we're doing all the building we can. Kydonia, we're not. Okay, build a wall. Um... You bring you down to Lepsis Magna for next turn. 
One good thing about the Juliet the Brute Eye right now, it seems like they're putting a lot of fleets everywhere. Same as the Skippy Eye, which is probably helping us against all the, the naval rebels and stuff. Um, yeah, that looks like everything we can do. So thank you very much for watching, guys. We're going to take a break here. Uh, please remember to subscribe, like, follow me on Twitch. And comment down below your most nostalgic Total War game that you enjoy. I'm hoping you're enjoying this series. We're keeping it going. We're probably going to go until, you know, we defeat the Romans, really. That's probably our, our, our aim. Um, but thank you for watching, guys, once again. And I'll see you again in the next video.